Hey guys, what's going on? I hope you're all doing great. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be reviewing this beautiful pair of sunglasses that I recently purchased at Balenciaga. Um, I was looking for this style for quite some time, like a few months, and I had seen a black version of this beautiful glasses but then when I got to the store I saw this um, shade of green which really caught my eye and interested me so much and yeah I don't have anything like this so I thought it would be a great idea to have a different color in my collection since everything I have is like black, brown, uh, beige, white, just the classic colors. So yeah. Um, firstly, I would like to start talking about my experience in the store. Um, I purchased these glasses at the Balenciaga Boutique in London in um, Bond Street, Mayfair. And the store is really, really beautiful. Um, the interior design is very minimalistic and clean and very modern. I'll insert a few pictures on the screen so you guys can see what I'm talking about if you've never seen it or visited the store. And this store has that concept of raw architecture concept and it's really really beautiful, very interesting. And um, I had to wait a few minutes outside to enter the store because there were a few customers um, in the store so the security told me to wait a few minutes uh, until somebody would finish purchasing whatever they were looking for. And then they would have um, an available associate to take care of me. Um, so I just basically waited for maybe five minutes outside. And then, um, yeah. So as soon as I walked into the store, an associate approached me uh, she was very warm and welcoming, very friendly. Um, she made me feel very comfortable and wel welcome into the store. So she immediately asked me what I was looking for, if I was looking for anything in particular. Then I told her that I was looking for sunglasses. So she uh, directed me and escorted me to the area where they have all the sunglasses displayed and um, so yeah I started browsing and looking through the sunglasses and um, I didn't see the pair that I had in mind which is this pair that I have right now that I purchased uh, so I showed her a picture and um, she told me that they didn't have it in black anymore and they had it in this particular color that I got, the green one, and they also had it in a kind of like goldish color. Uh, and which is very interesting is that on the website, they only have two colors available. They have it in black and this other gold one that I actually saw in store. So yeah, I don't know why the green one is not available online. I don't know if this is an exclusive color for that particular store or maybe it's gonna come up online soon. I re really don't have an idea. Um, and it's interesting because that store is a flagship store. Um, so basically a flagship store is a store that would carry everything they have to offer within the brand. 
Uh, they would carry the lifestyle, they would carry ready to wear, runway, everything. And just for you to understand a little bit more what a flagship store means, is that a flagship store is the, the lead store in a retail chain acting as a showcase for the brand. So that store would really represent the brand. Um, so yeah, this particular shade, I don't know if it's exclusive for stores only or for that particular store. And as of right now, it's not available online and yeah but either way this is the pair i'll put it on so you can see what it looks like on i really love this uh style it's got this kind of like slanted cat eye effect um I feel like this style is very kind of like late 90s, early 2000s inspired. Um, I remember like as a teenager, a lot of the sunglasses would kind of like look like this, you know, especially like the sports kind of like style. Um, they will look like this and... Uh, but of course, this is a, an updated version of that, uh, being a little bit more modern and with a more high fashion approach. And yeah, I really love it. So like I mentioned, initially I wanted the black pair, but they didn't have it available and I actually love the green one. I think it's very unique and different from everything I've had in my collection. And yeah. So to take a look closely, right here on the temple, you would have the Balenciaga um, engraved on the arm. And uh, the lenses are kind of like a tint, tinted green as well. It's fairly lightweight, I would say. And it's very comfortable on. Uh, right here on the inside, you have some like, I think, style number. And then right here on the other side, on the, on the right temple, it says Balenciaga and it says made in Italy. And uh, yeah, some other information here. And these glasses are 100% nylon. Uh, it's not acetate, like usually the brands. Every other brand, I think, like, like, like the usual sunglasses, they're usually made of acetate, uh, but this one is 100% nylon. I think it's for the weight, I think the nylon is a little bit more lightweight than acetate, which makes it more comfortable. And it's got some sort of like nose pads here. So it sits very comfortably on your nose. So yeah, and this is and this is the the case that the sunglasses come in. I think this is leather, and it's like a shell case kind of style because it's hard. You know, it's not it's not soft um, case, and it again the Balenciaga. 
uh, logo engraved right here on top and this is what the interior looks like it has the balenciaga logo all over it and the interior looks like a suede type of material or like a like a velvety kind of material i would say which is very nice and it stays close very secure and the sunglasses also comes in this little dust bag dust cover whatever you want to call it with the drawstring and it has the balenciaga logo over there in the front as well so i feel like it's a very high quality type of sunglasses and of course it's 100 percent uva and uvb uh, protection I don't think I ever mentioned the style. It's called D-Frame Shape. And just a little bit more information that they uh, display on the website about these sunglasses is that uh, the temple length is 4.5 inch. The bridge length is uh, zero, 0 0.7 inch. It's a standard fit and it's not suitable for optical conversion. So yes, and uh, this is actually my second pair of uh, Balenciaga sunglasses. The first pair I got um, was this pair right here. I will show you guys really quick. The, the, the case is very similar to this one right here. It's just like a little bit slim since the the sunglasses are a little bit uh, smaller or they would fold a little bit more flat so the case is uh, a little flatter but it's basically the same style and it came with the cloth like this instead of that dust bag and this is the style so as you can see it folds flat like more flat comparing to this one and this one is more of like a windshield squared uh, type of shape a little bit more classic i would say uh, and it's in black and this is what it looks like on It's very classic style, but also I think that it's very fashion forward and definitely a staple uh, in my collection. It's very elegant. And again, it's 100% nylon, the material. Uh, also UVA, UVB protection, 100%. It has the interlock B detail on the bridge. Um, it's got the nose pads in the inner part of the sunglasses, so it, it sits very comfortably on your nose. And it's very lightweight. And yeah, it has no uh, Balenciaga logos imprinted on the temples uh, you would only have the balenciaga logo here on the right arm in the inner part and then it says made in italy right here so yeah this is it um i hope you guys like this type of review um i'm gonna finish off wearing them so please uh, let me know if you have any questions uh, make sure you give me a thumbs up 
subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys on the next one bye guys